What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the different classes you will be able to take in Hogwarts Legacy. This information has come out recently because the game is getting close to launch. A lot more news is coming out about the game. And as of right now, we know four different classes you can take in game. First of all, of course, Defense Against the Dark Arts. This is going to be a class that will protect, keep, teach you to be protected from curses. While also attending this class in Hogwarts Legacy, you'll be able to learn how to cast offensive spells. When it comes to Herbology, Herbology teaches you about plant life that can, be a found, uh, that can be found around Hogwarts and the campus. This will be a good thing to do if you're going to kind of want to know what plants are deadly and what kind of plants are worth watching out for in case you want to turn them into potions. The potions class will teach you to uh, kind of craft concoctions and this will allow you to then figure out which ones will be useful for a variety of different situations when exploring the Hogwarts campus. And then there will be the charms class. This will be another class that teaches you spells that allow you to interact with your environment. So far, that's all we know of. These are the four classes that have been confirmed. It could be possible that we will get more at launch that we just do not know about yet. It could be possible we get more down the road. There's always there's already been rumors of expansions and DLC coming to Hogwarts Legacy, even though the game's not out yet. But I think as of right now, those are going to be the four classes that a lot of people would, if you've seen the movies, those are going to be the ones that you think about when you see the movies. And I think there's a lot they could do with just these four classes. They definitely can expand on the classes itself. Once you take them and you start learning things, maybe the longer you take the class, the more you start to learn within that class, the more options you have for each individual one. You know, charms, potions, herbology, and defense against the dark arts. I'm not quite sure how they're going to build on this kind of to revolve around your character with spells and whatnot. But I think there's definitely a lot they could do. I'm not sure if they would have to add more anytime soon. I think they could really do a lot, especially especially when this game is going to be a open world kind of action RPG. There's a lot of things you can do with each one of these classes. There's even like, you could take ideas from other games. I'm not sure if they have done this. It's kind of just an idea off the top of my head. But you could really expand like for herbology, for example. If you want to know, you know, different types of, of plants and things and what types of these plants are deadly and what types would be worthwhile for you to have for, you know, good or evil, I guess you would say, and make those into potions, you could have skill trees within each one of these classes that would kind of teach you different things uh, the longer that, you know, you kind of use it and the longer you work with it. But anyway, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you think about these classes. Let me know what other classes you might like to see later down the road or at some point, maybe even in the game when it launches. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.